We are in a race with climate change, with biodiversity loss, a race to ensure that people and nature can thrive on this planet. At the Nature Conservancy, we protect the places that can help us win this race. Welcome to the Jack and Laura Dangerman Preserve. The Jack and Laura Dangerman Preserve is critically important to conservation because it's one of the last places on the California coast what we might think of as wild. It's undeveloped, it's really not impacted by humans. The Dangerman Preserve plays a number of really important roles for conservation. The species that are found here and found nowhere else in the world, this is the last stronghold for them. But the ones that I'm studying are mountain lions and black bears. Although usually mountain lions and black bears stay in the forests and sometimes in the mountains. Here on the Dangerman Preserve, both of these animals might be using the beaches to get food. And all of these ideas are adding up that this space is super special. We're within the shadow of 20 plus million people. Big cities like Los Angeles and San Diego have really pushed a lot of these species to the brink. And this is one of the last places where we have a representation of what things used to be. There's this really beautiful and interesting mixing that happens in our ocean waters off the coast. It's where the northern and southern California currents meet. We have species from the south moving northward and species from the north mixing with those southern species. This place is, is so special culturally because of what it means to my tribe's religion and spirituality. It's the stepping off point where our souls leave this earth to the afterlife. The last 10,000 years in the three occupations is really a testament to the resilience of our, of our people because we, after that time, are still here in the area that we settled. Protected land could actually be a way of preserving and conserving the land for future generations. And so for the environmental education program here at the Dangerman Preserve to be part of a strategy to envision to take care of this place overall, I think is an amazing opportunity. This generation coming up, these new conservation leaders, they're the ones I am confident going to solve a lot of our environmental problems. We're gonna have climate change, we're going to have fires, we're gonna have a lot of stuff to figure out. But knowing that this space has been through so much already and continued to be wonderful gives us a lot of hope for what the future looks like.